A cloudy day ahead with outbreaks of rain for many. The outlook turns colder with the return of nighttime frosts. I'll have all the details of that and more coming up on Good Morning Britain. Wednesday. What the spectacular is having in the heavens, isn't it? Yes, we are going Pancakes to... flying <laughs> through the sky. <laughs> it will look like a partial pancake tonight because we have the moon rising, but we also have two planets very close together and they're going to get closer and closer over the next few weeks. Jupiter and Venus. So just after sunset tonight, you'll see them shining in the night sky. The moon will be there as well. And over the next week, they'll slowly get closer and closer. So if you see two twinkling bright lights in the sky, they're not stars, it's Jupiter and Venus. Good morning to you. The weather has been relatively mild and dry over the last few weeks. That all changes today and in our outlook we have a weather front slipping south. It is a cold front. Behind that it allows colder air to filter in. So we go from temperatures being above average to being around about or if not below average. A northerly blast also means to where we've been. So how do things change as we head through the next seven days? Well I think the big trend is our temperature. We look at our daytime temperatures. So for the north of the UK, Scotland, Northern Ireland, northern areas of England, the city around about average but because it's been so mild it actually will feel fairly chilly particularly in the coming nights with frost returning percentage chance of rainfall across the north we have our band of rain moving its way southwards today but then the outlook with high pressure moving in is largely fine and dry so some decent spells of sunshine albeit a little bit chilly in that northerly wind fortunes further south for england and wales for the next seven days well temperature wise again it has been mild but slowly we see those temperatures falling below average as we head into next week Percentage chance of rainfall, how out we are to see wet weather. Well, today looks wettest with the cloud and rain. It slowly eases and then the outlook fine and dry. But watch out for the return of those nighttime frosts. Good morning to you. Now the weather is changing. We have a weather front with us. It brings with it cloud and rain. The first rain many of us have seen for quite a while and it's a cold front, meaning colder weather is set to move in. Winds turn northerly as we head through the next few days and that means temperatures tumble both by day and by night. So actually temperature wise we've been above average. Good morning to you. A wet start to the day and then it's set to turn colder for all of us. But for today, it's the cloud and rain that moves south, then brighter skies follow, but that comes with colder air. So this morning, it actually starts off mild and cloudy thanks to outbreaks of rain that sit through particularly eastern areas of the UK, so eastern Scotland, eastern areas of and I can give you a definitive answer of what's happening. And at the moment, it's cloudy and wet. A band of rain slips southwards and then things turn colder. It's behind that we see some sunshine returning, but temperatures will actually fall as we head through the day. It was mild yesterday, highs of 14, and mild start to the day today with cloudy skies, but rain for eastern Scotland and eastern areas of England, so a dull, damp start. The rain clears from eastern Scotland and the sunshine returns. It lingers for the east this is a cold front behind it. All of this air is much colder than the air we had yesterday. So gone pretty much to the double digits. We're looking between six and nine degrees for many. And the northerly wind, despite more sunshine today, will make it feel chilly. Cold enough for some wintry showers for the north of Scotland, sunshine and showers for the Wales in the southwest. But that rain lingers in the southeast. <laughs>